All right, our latest edition, 10 random questions. This time, Jeff Mayweather with TNA Superstar and Bellator fighter King Mo. 10 questions, guys. First question. All right. Um, what was your favorite Halloween costume growing up? I was a fat man. Because cheap, because I used to wear sweats. I used to put pillows underneath. Because we can afford no uh, real costume. I was a fat man. <laughs> I'm the black man. That's <laughs> <laughs> what that was. That, that's it? <laughs> that's it, man. All right, who, who's who's the best villain from any, any movie? Your favorite villain? I like People from Shaft, the remake. <laughs> I like um, Hannibal. Hannibal Lecter? Yeah. All right. Everybody's committed a crime sometime in their life, usually when they're little. So give us a little story. For instance, I, when I was seven years old, my cousin led me around, and I we used to rob uh, convenience stores of, of sodas and that kind of thing. So give us an example of what you did. You rob convenience stores and see me steal? My little brother loaded you me steal. up. Well, you steal. steal. That's not robbing. <laughs> robbing is this. Gunpoint. So what, what do you guys got? Um, I got many of them. Man. Well, no. Wait a my situation was, was really robbery. <laughs> no, because I used to hang out with Roger. We came from football practice. It was about probably about, about seven of us. We went into the sporting goods. And Roger said, Jeff, go get that bat and hold it on that guy. I said, I mean, I just want to be Roger. So I was hanging out with him and I did exactly what he told me to do. I held the bat on the guy. Everybody that came in the store took whatever they wanted, and then we left. So I, I did a robbery, for real. But <laughs> I hope the statute of limitations is over with, so I'll go to jail. <laughs> and Mo? Uh, man, I got one of them. Uh, when I was young, man, I used to like some Tic Tacs. The one Tic Tac. I think I was like a hair store. And uh, I stole some my mama at the, the grocery store. And uh, I was walking on soap, you know, when you walk real fast, you hear that sound. Mm. She's like, hurry up. So I, I ran up on him, got in the car, and got nervous. I get nervous, so uh, before I went to school, uh, I put the Tic Tacs on the ground and went inside, because I'd come back and grab them later. And this one cat named Jay Mott seemed to come down. So I'm inside, and my mom's saying bye to me, and Jay Mott comes in, it's like, hey, Mo, Mo, you left your candy outside. <laughs> And then I got, I got whooped, you know what I'm saying? I got home later that day. It was pretty bad. It was embarrassing, but you know, I, was on, I was young. All right, uh, there's been a lot of talk about the last couple of days. What do you guys, what's your impression of each other's hair or lack of? We know he needs a texturizer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think Hawaiian silk. This is George, this George <laughs> Jefferson. This is George Jefferson. Tay Day here, but he's Uncle Phil. <laughs> All right, give me. Give me your best Fleece Johnson impression. Go ahead, it's your man. I don't, I don't, I don't see him on TV. That's his man. That's his man. That's his man. What did what we say? We can do this. Easy way. Yeah, we, we can do, do it the easy way. way. We can do it the hard way. Most of the time, they always they always do the easy way. I Jeff, never had to do nothing. Jeff gave it to me. <laughs> We're no fighting. We're he, no fighting. He he say Fleece is a booty warrior. I respect that. Nah, nah, I see the warrior though. At least he's a warrior though. <laughs> oh, he at least he's a warrior. He's a warrior. He's still a booty warrior. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> All right, a boxing question. Who's your favorite current boxer besides uh, Floyd and is competing right now? Uh, I think probably... You can't be Ward. training him. No, probably Andre Ward. Right. Mo? Uh, I really got I got more than one. You know what I'm saying? A couple that you like. Adrian Bro, uh, Ward, Sergio. Um, you know, I, I like uh, seeing. Got the whole pop bound is. Gary Russell. You know what I'm saying? I'm seeing him fight. You know, you know Rashid came up, made a pro debut. I like, you know, Saddam Ali, because I know some of the cats from the Amherst. Yeah. You know, we train some of the so. Uh, Ronda Rousey just signed with the UFC. She'll be fighting uh, Liz Carmouche here shortly. Uh, thoughts on women competing at the top level and top organizations or in elite organizations in MMA? I don't care. 
How does that happen? I think they have it right, just like just like anyone else, as long as they're competing against one another. All right, then the last boxing question. Who do you want to see Floyd fight next? Who do you want to see him fight next? I would, I mean, it only makes sense to me is Canelo. So I don't, I don't, I can't even think beyond Canelo because there's no one else that I think that he should fight. Mm -hmm. I like to see him beat Timothy Bradley. But that's the okay. Canelo. I mean, I want to see him beat Robert Guerrero. You know, whoever, 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 whoever get them big paydays, but Canelo's the, the main front runner. Sergio Martinez is small. I, I like to see him fight Sergio, but he's too big. Right. What impresses the ladies most about you? Him? Nothing. That's why you never <laughs> see him. <laughs> right, well, you, you can ask him. Why you always see him with Tate? <laughs> <laughs> My man Tate. Well, answer for yourselves then. Go ahead, go first. It can't be the hair either. I know that. <laughs> the hair. It's the conversation. That's it. The conversation. Uh, I mean, hey, I got charm. <laughs> With me, it's because it's everything. Not my personality. I'm the I'm the whole pack, total package. You know, I'm the black Lex Luger, the total package. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? How much did each of you make for your first professional fight? That ain't your business. <laughs> Let me think. I think I think I made. $800. I was balling. I made way more than that. <laughs> well, it was 30 years later, though. So. No, but because in Japan, they put me to get beat. They put me to get beat. I got paid uh, 50000 50, What? Your <laughs> first fight? Yeah. Oh, shit, I'm mad. But they put me to get destroyed. It's like we noticed. They, they ain't nobody else. <laughs> All right, we got that, that was a 10th one. We got a bonus. Two questions. First, real quick, who's your favorite horseman? Rick Flair. Horseman? Yeah, yeah. He's a horseman. You say Rick Flair. You, know, you, like, you like Rick Flair? I don't even know who Rick Flair is. Nah, man, you should. He's a wrestler? Yeah. The nature boy. The four horsemen. Who is your favorite of them? Who is it? Who Rick Flair. Flair. They, 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 it, it, it always changes. You say Rick Flair. Rick Flair or Arne Anderson. Uh, oh, all right. That's mine. Rick Flair or Give, me, give me a name of one. I might know him. Rick Flair or Mongo Anderson. McMichaels for you. Michael who? Chris Lamar was one. I don't know them cats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, go ahead. La last question in honor of <laughs> in honor of Mo's next fight. Uh, I want you to spell his name. Mo, let's have you take Misiala and, and Jeff, you try Perzem Perzemislaw. So Mo, you Perzemislaw. E R I S. S L O W. Do you have any idea? First name? Either one of them. I forgot. M I, I forgot S Y M E K. <laughs> what? No, Misiela. The... <laughs> oh, no, no. I don't know. See, that's called coleslaw. <laughs> coleslaw. All right, guys. That's that's twelve random questions with King Mo and Jeff Mayweather.